welcome back to my channel so do you know what i have been like really trying to think about what to film in january but i remembered that i've actually bought a bit in the boxing day sales and i got that saver delivery so this is a bit late but it's still a collective haul a try on clothing haul and then a little bit of makeup as well which i feel like is exciting so yeah this is asos plt boohoo and beauty bay so if this seems like a bit of you and i can link everything i hope some of it is still on offer but yeah um i'll put it all down below and if this seems like a bit of you please keep on watching also i showed this zip up chocolate hoodie in a vlogmas so if i can find this as well it's like um got a hoop as a zip um i can link this down below as well so but i just i didn't show it in a try on clip because i put it in a vlogmas are you should watch that right so i reckon we start with clothes and also in this video i got two items of clothing for christmas which was in my what i got for christmas i'll link that down below um god i'm linking a lot down below aren't i <laughs> false promises i hope i do it um but yeah i thought i could show you them on as well and i'll do a split screen so the first is this i got this in the you know when it, the sales begin just before christmas um i found this so this is from the men's section it's like borg teddy material navy it says pittsburgh on i didn't show this in the try and clip but it has a hood i mean this i wear i got in a larger size to wear as a dress so how cute is that i'm obsessed like if I could wear this everywhere, and I have a picture of it on the gram, so hmm, check that out. But yeah, men's, ASOS, you can't go wrong. Always check the men's section. It's got hood. It's good for the UK weather. Am I right, ladies and gents? Okay, so next. I feel like you all know I'm very obsessed with a shirt dress. So, satin cotton any i love them nights out when you're just chilling when you like honestly anything job interview so so these ones are collusion on asos why is this falling off i need some non-slip hangers it makes me so angry <laughs> so these are um from collusion you need to get like two sizes smaller because they always come up really oversized so um it's not much to say other than it's a black shirt dress and i love it i literally have this in chocolate brown mocha white and another color which i'll show now but i think this is such a staple i can't believe i didn't have a black um this was about 16 pound in the sale and i think they're nearly they're either 18 or 20 pounds which isn't even that bad anyway but literally love 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 that and they're just like not see-through really good material feel really nice okay so leading on how cute is this and how nice is this one this is a like i think it's like a sage green pistachio so literally the same one but i just love these so much like i can't tell you how much i love these shirt dresses because i'm five foot two three yeah i'm not five foot four we'll say five foot three we'll, we'll give ourselves a little but they aren't long and i know it sounds really weird but i don't like things long on me i have short stubby fat legs like if anything's long it just doesn't look nice so i need something that's a bit shorter which is long enough at the back your bum ain't coming out it's just the sides come up a little bit we can just put some cycling shorts on no one will know how stunning is this green though i feel like all the try on clips i did when it was light i literally was like making sure that i would get them in 
while it was light so if i look a bit different it's because i've been running around all day doing nothing but basically these shirts are my favorite thing ever i think the chocolate brown and the mocha one are probably my favorite and then this sort of green then the white and the black are just staples aren't they really but look at this honestly if they have any more colors come out they had a pink one but it wasn't like just all pink it had some sort of like checkered pattern on it which i think i'd just prefer it if it was like a light pink but if they get any more you'll see it in another haul then on asos they have these like i mean this is like the cheapest feeling necklace you could possibly ever get but they look cool now it's just a chunky necklace everyone's wearing it at the minute let's grab it everyone is wearing these at the minute so i was like i'm gonna get one it was three pound in the sale um and i really like it i wore it in my testing new makeup video for my christmas presents and i really liked it with the outfit i was wearing i feel like with certain outfits it can look cheap and horrible but when you got the right vibe like like i feel like with a hoodie i wouldn't like it but with a dress i like it that makes sense but yeah just cheap material gold um oh it's so annoying on etsy i've ordered a 1997 necklace the year i was born i feel like they've been going around a lot at the minute but it didn't come in time and i didn't want to wait any longer to film this so there was going to be two necklaces in here but this is all you're getting i want a jewelry stand though i want to get into jewelry i wear nothing i don't even have my ears pierced like honestly it's a whole other story <laughs> okay <laughs> then i got these joggers so these are from a limited collection on asos and they are literally just like a brown quite cheap but they were cheap they're literally 10 pounds these are just to wear to bed so it's not that exciting but um I always get these like one size bigger as well, just so comfy to like lounge around in. But here's the clip. I mean, I don't know why I'm showing. There's a try on clip, but uh, to be fair, before I literally filmed all the try on clips and forgot about these, and I felt guilty. So hopefully it came out okay. I didn't really get that. Normally I do like a good couple, you know, just to see how they're going, how they're going along. But yeah, joggers to wear at home, chilling. I won't go out in these. They don't look nice on my bum, and they look a bit. A bit see-through a bit but i mean if you just lounge around the house and put a big t-shirt on you're good to go aren't you really okay let's move on to boohoo.com so i only have two things right you might be thinking lorraine you literally have one of these i don't know if you can see it peeking through just there but this one is a bigger size and i thought that this was going to be long but it's just wide which i'm quite annoyed about like, I literally was like, I'm having the biggest size they have, it'd be like a long dress. Um, but I feel like I do prefer this one because it is longer um, in a weird way. And I do really, really like this trend. So I am still glad I bought it and it was in the sale. Um, and it is a different pattern to the other one. Like, have you seen myself? The other one's white. Where it's white here and here, that one's black. And the hound tooth print is different like quite a bit different so like if you heard myself it's like literally okay they were literally in the sale array like it's fine but i think i prefer this one i do really really like it like the sweater um vest trend is one of my favorites i wish i suited it more um but i have to get anything in like this print i just love it i'm obsessed the next thing is literally in the same print but i think this was about 16 pound in the sale boohoo can't go wrong this next thing was about £30 and I'm not going to lie, I am one of them people that my clothes, like, they don't really cost that much, like, anything more than £25, I don't really like to get it, um, I'm not going to lie to you, like, some of this £35, I'm like, oh, am I going to wear it that much for that kind of money, like, honestly, what cheapskate, <laughs> but I mean, like, I... I feel like all my clothes are just relatively normal pricing and I do buy a bit of them on ASOS and things like Pretty Little Thing which can be quite fast fashion but everything I have bar probably like free items and I have quite a bit of clothing I literally use for years like years years I don't I don't think it's right that people throw things away after a season like we live in the UK okay I need coats in summer like 
my coats from last year and the year before i'm still wearing now and i still always wear you know what i mean it's just one of them like i won't have like five black coats i'll have one black coat maybe like two white ones it's just one of them but sorry for the rant but i feel bad sometimes showing clothing pieces like this but i hope you can see that i literally hardly ever do clothing hauls i think i have two on my channel um and obviously this is from christmas money and in the sale and again it's not really that much so i'm also i'm quite sorry if you thought this is going to be like a lot of things but let's just get into it so this they had one on misguided as well in red but owen was like mm, don't like that one but he likes this one um so imagine this with like my chocolate brown or like bra i think they call it mocha mocha shirt dress and this on top with like a really nice brown bag I, don't, I need a brown bag i don't have a brown bag okay so look at this it's like hound tooth it's really nice it's like frayed i feel like this does look like a bit expensive i mean i don't really like the gold buttons on it i'm not gonna lie i don't know why i didn't think they came with that but i still think this is really really nice this is very me shirts blazers i like to look smart or i like to look like this i like to wear on a hoodie or men's tops there's just no in between um but this is really really nice material it is a bit tight on my arms which annoys me because you buy things from boohoo in the same size and one will be massive one will be a bit tight and you're like but i like the fit of it regardless i mean i literally have big boobs so it just happens but yeah i really really love this okay okay <laughs> this is the last clothing item this coat was in the sale for 25 pounds on pretty little thing and my other white coat there i like it but it's quite a thin coat and this is more of like a cream big fluffy coat that's going to keep you really warm and that's just going to look nice in my white jumpers if that makes sense honestly though it was 25 pounds and i have my um, i got a black coat from pretty little thing last year in the sale for 25 pounds i've been wearing it all this year in my vlogs it's just like a big oversized black one um this is what it looks like it's literally the same coat i have but in a cream so it's got like tortoise shell buttons it's really really big and fluffy like honestly this is my new favorite coat like I've got a trench, like a faux leather, and my black one that I always wear. And I do have a few there as well. But I, it's so weird. Like, last winter, I had one coat, and now I have loads. But I'm not going to lie. The weather, the UK is weird, right? It'll be very hot in, like, April. And then you get to actual summer, and it's like... Like, we all went camping last year and got stuck in a storm in august and it rained and it was horrible like you can't predict the weather in the uk you always need a coat and i know it sounds weird but like when when i put the try on clip with the green shirt on and this i was like i love it you've sold me like you when you go out in the evening somewhere nice you want to wear a nice dress this is the coat to put on top i think personally i just love it Honestly, th to be fair, I feel like I have bought a bit too many coats this year, even though it's only been like three. But I just feel a bit bad about it. And I'm sorry, but I love it. And it was literally £25 and I can't wait to wear it. If I don't wear this in like five different vlogs, tell me off. But I literally love this and you've probably seen it a lot next winter and all throughout the year because we are in the UK, sweethearts. Let's get on to Beauty Bay yay how nice is this so my friend um lydia one of my best friends like she we've not seen each other in a while because we live near each other but like it can be an hour away in traffic even though it is quite near <laughs> but she for my birthday was meant to give me some presents but obviously we went into lockdown and she sent me a 20 pound voucher for beauty bay which is so cute. They just sent something else as well, but it's not arrived yet. But that is literally the cutest thing ever. Like, I love you so much. Thank you. It literally made my day, like... And then I saw Beauty Bay had a sale on for Boxing Day. And I was like... This has come at the right time. I'm very happy. So, 
I only got two things, but I think they're really, really nice. So the first thing I got, I literally opened it up yesterday. I was so excited, is the Sunset Horizons palette. It was on sale for £10. And this... And this palette, okay, this looks like so good, like £10. No, you can't go wrong, you just can't. I'm telling you right now. Let me show you. So move the film. I think the light's better on that side. Look at them, like the yellows, the orange row, blue. I'm obsessed with blue. And you even have like a navy. And then I, I just, I... I understand that a lot of people have done reviews on this palette and is it the Book of Magic, which is like, um, that one was on sale for £7.50. I nearly got that. And then, I don't know, I was sold on this one because it did still have blue in it, but also other colours. So I could take it away with me. Like it even has like a little pink, a really nice hot pink, favourite ever, purple, £10. If you want a look on this palette, please let me know. But I know a lot of looks have been going around on YouTube when this first came out. And I'm very, very late to the bandwagon. But if you want any of these colours, um, please let me know. But I'll probably do a get ready. That mirror's annoying me. I will probably do a get ready with these anyway. Um, but just in case, please let me know what type of colours you want me to use. Um, or if you're not interested, then that's alright. But... I just want to play with it. I'm so excited. And how cute is that as well? Honestly, Beauty Bay eyeshadows are one of my favourites. I think they are so, so pigmented. Um, I had them on my eyes today. Just in case you're wondering. I got this. And you're going to be thinking, what? This it's just gonna sit on my desk and I'm not even lying to you. I thought this was the cutest thing that I've ever seen. It matches my pink skincare fridge and it's gonna sit next to it looking all pretty. Maybe, I, I mean, if you want a review on it, I'll happily do one. How do I open this? So this, I'm pretty sure this was not in the sale. So I'm very sorry about that. But this is from Makeup Revolution and it's the Call for Cleansing and it's a cleansing brush with two different heads. I can't get into this. I love it. Hello? Hi, I'm all right, how are you? I'm not being funny. You need this to just sit on your desk. I'm not gonna lie, it's a lot smaller. It's tiny, right? And I thought, for eight pounds, you better be giving me a big, a big cleansing brush that can sit on my desk and look pretty, but <laughs> God, God. Right, I'll put that down, I'm getting too excited. Oh my, oh, right, so this is like a really like fluffy brush with like bubble heads. <gasps> and then this one is like um, an actual cleansing brush, like, that you'd buy that would vibrate oh my god can you put like batteries in this or not no i don't think so it's got a little calling face i can't i can't talk right now i'm doing hot girl shit this feels really good as well if you want me to do a review on this um from actually cleansing i also um got the beauty bay cleanser for christmas let me get it out my so I also got this as well. If you want a review on this, I will happily do that as well. I've not used this yet. I'm going to use it tonight. But this one um, vibrates and it has like two separate sides. So, and this is USB charged. I wish this one vibrated. I mean, does it? I don't know. Can you put batteries in? I don't think so. But that is the cutest thing i've ever seen and it's just gonna sit on my desk unless anyone wants a review no i need to stop doing that I'm, I'm not even funny i'm not even funny right now i'm are you not embarrassed this is really embarrassing so i really really hope that you enjoyed this video if you did please like and subscribe i'm so close to 400 my phone died <laughs> then i got sidetracked and watch ellie darby's like pregnancy video again google chill <laughs> then started like crying
crying and I thought like, I need to film an outro to this video oh my god so luckily I pulled it together I've already seen it I don't know what I'm crying for again am I okay we don't know anymore please let me know if you want a cleanser review or um, a beauty bay cleanser review or the palette anything to do with the palette please let me know any styling videos look books i'll do anything for you all within reason no dead bodies <laughs> okay i'm gonna go now because i'm being weird again i'll see you hopefully tomorrow for another video bye